Power 93.7 WBLK. I'm Yasmin Young. This is the 2 to 6 Takeover. Now, you know we always drop the new hot joints on you. And I have got one that is an exclusive coming right out of Buffalo. And it centers around the coronavirus of all things. But it's got a great message, which is trying to engage people in the safety measures that we all need to take to make sure that we are not spreading the coronavirus. And I actually have the creator of it, Ray. Even the science maven. Welcome. Hi, Esmond. Thank you for having me on here. I am so excited to talk to you. Now, you are actually a STEM educator. You're the director of collegiate STEM initiatives with Health Sciences Charter School. So you work with children and you work in this industry. And your song is Boosie song is called Wipe Me Down. But your song is called Wipe It Down. Yes. So how did you even come up with this idea? I know you've done other songs before, like Big Old Geek, which is a play on Megan's Megan the Stallion's Big Old Freak. What made you come up with this? Um, well, I actually started out as a corporate molecular scientist. And um, one of the techniques that we use in that area is called the sterile technique. And in that technique, you wipe things down. Um, you take a, a spray bottle filled with basically rubbing alcohol. And when you're doing work that has to be sterile, you have to spray down your environment, wipe it down, and keep it clean. <laughs> so, of course, <laughs> when the coronavirus, uh, COVID-19 pandemic occurred, I realized how important it was to get the message out there that people do need to understand wiping it down is important. Um, using Lysol and Clorox are two two ways to do that. Well, when you when you use a word like molecular, I don't usually put that in the same category as rap. H- had you previously <laughs> done rap or hip hop? How did this all tie together? Well, I used to make beats and songs when I was in high school. Um, like, for example, um, there there was a instance where somebody, you know, wanted to start a rumor about me and there was a little drama but instead of directly engaging with the drama I wrote a diss track (laughs) and I put the diss track on a CD and I distributed it and you know it eventually got all around the school and you know I got in a little trouble for it but um, you know I've always used music to give myself a voice and um, now that I had a little downtime I just got right back to it. I love it. And and it's so relatable to, you know, the younger generation because this is what they're listening to. You, well, OK, maybe maybe wipe, wipe me down was a little bit older. I think I was in college when that came out, but it's still <laughs> relatable to the younger folks. And it's and it still gives that message and gets that message across to them in a way that they can relate to versus just saying, hey, you need to wipe things down, you know, which is true, but not quite as exciting as wipe it down. And and you rapping right. about it. <laughs> Thank you so much. So what has been, I've uh, seen yeah. that you've gone viral. What has been the response to the song? Oh, it's been incredibly positive. I made the song in, honestly, I made it in two hours. It took me a day to make that video. Um, and I really did not expect it to blow up like that. But I've had people reach out to me, um, fellow scientists, honestly, a lot of fellow scientists wanting to connect, asking me about how to engage the public in understanding science. A lot of teachers who want to understand how to engage, you know, underrepresented youth in science. And um, it's just been a huge blessing to be able to kind of widen uh, the public understanding of the virus and put that information in front of people who otherwise might have missed it. I love it. Well, listen, where can people follow you? I know that you're on Twitter, Facebook. You've got a website. Give that information out so people can connect with you. Sure. So you can find me on Facebook. I'm Raven the Science Maven on Facebook. I am at Raven the Science Maven on Instagram. You can find my YouTube channel where I have a lot of engaging science education content and more music videos um, on my YouTube channel and my Twitter. I am at Raven Sci Maven. Raven S C I Maven. Um, I'm also giving a TEDx talk soon where I talk more about how I bridge together rap music and science education. And that's going to be streamed online because of the pandemic. But um, luckily that means everybody will be able to see it. So I'll definitely um, put that on my social media once I get the links. 
I love it. Keep up the great work. Um, I love seeing that merger of hip hop, rap and education, especially when it comes to STEM. So kudos to you, Raven. And thank you for uh, sharing with us. Of course. Thank you for having me. Stay healthy. Thank you. You too. And you can tap that app to check out the video at WBLK.